All right, here we go. We've done lots of interviews in the past, but this is the first time actually at Boosie Estate, Boosie Estates, to be accurate, on 88 acres with a huge house. How many square footage is the house? Uh, like 26,000 square feet. 26,000 square feet. How many uh, bedrooms and bathrooms? 13 bedrooms, 10 baths. Crazy. And all this was basically just raw land. All this was nothing but grass in 2016. And I moved in probably 2017, 18. Yeah. Okay, and you built this whole this whole house custom. Yeah, designed Big, it myself. Designed it, built it, built it, customized it. it everything and when I and I, I was only two two years home so I didn't I didn't have the money to build it all at once I got the foundation and I built it weekend for weekend mm. 40,000 40,000 40,000 30,000 20,000 so if I do it you know anybody can do it amazing amazing it's like my front room when you first walk in Got the chandelier up there, pay the buck for it. <laughs> this is my red room. If you look good, I got gold flakes in the ceiling, but you gotta really look. This is like my red room, where I put all my, my people who are in love. Me in trouble, bleak eyed, uh, I mostly have boosted pictures on the wall. I mean, I'm my own motivation. That's Bleak, my best friend who was murdered. That's me and Bleak again. This is just like in their room right here where motherfuckers sit down and, and just chill out or whatever. That's Marilyn up there. I'm a Marilyn Monroe head. Probably the only dead person I still jack off to. I never take down my Christmas trees. They've been up there since 2017, since I moved in. So uh, I never take down my Christmas trees. That's that's important to me. We can go this way. This is like my second home. I wake up here every morning. This is my studio. This is where we film, we usually film the Vlad TV interviews. Yeah. Well, when I'm not actually present. <laughs> Today we had to do something a little different. <laughs> this is me and Vlad be doing the interviews that we y'all think he okay. Y'all think he here. But uh he's not, but today he's here, so this is where I, I got a couple legends with legends on the wall. This is where I basically do do everything, bro. Like this is where I, you know, this is where it all started at with the music. Yo, you got a bowling alley in here. My bowling alley, badass alley. I mean, you got the game, ping pong. That's Tootie Room, but I'm not going in it because I don't know what's in it. I don't know what's. <laughs> you might have a girl in the bed, I don't know. This is my club right here, bro. I think it had some fat bitches in it uh, a couple days ago because they broke the stripper pole. This is my club right here. Uh, we have we have some good times in here. That's the uh, lap dance chair. Stripper pole is broken. I don't know what happened. Stripper pole is broken. I think it was my son and some and his and his people. This is my barber shop. I got a blue and a red chair. Uh, the blue chair for the Crips, the red chair for the Bloods. Because when people do features and they be gangbangers or something, one guy say, I don't want to sit in a blue chair. So I got a blue chair and a red chair to accommodate people who come do features and want the haircut. This is my elevator. This is 
my elevator. I like to get my dick sucked in the elevator. Uh, when, when, when I have when I have over eight people at the house, this is my escape. When I want to get hit, I get took down right here in the elevator. So, you know, it's a lifestyle. I always wanted the elevator in my house too. <laughs>